With the rise in the cost of petrol and its negative environmental effects, the idea of electric vehicles is gaining acceptance from individuals, organizations and governments around the world. Following the trend, the University of Lagos has built a solar energy charging point and an electric minibus made by students of the Faculty of Engineering. <laughs> electric vehicles are convenient, cheap to maintain, they consume less energy and of course are safe to drive. And this pilot project in conjunction with the National Automotive Design and Development Council will enable students have first-hand experience with the innovations. We have come up with our own and we are going to improve on what we have so that we will be able to have collaboration with the industry through the, the Federal Ministry of um, Trade Industry so that we have that collaboration. They will act as a the platform. Our students are able to come up with innovation, innovative ideas that will improve on what we have now. Then the university will register the company for them and also go and get a startup grant for the students to start their projects at their business after we have registered the business. And we are going to choose a mentor for them, a mentor for them that will advise them, that will lead them through the right path. The charging station contains installed solar panels coupled to online, offline hybrid inverters. The output is renewable energy to power a vehicle at any time and with little impact to the electricity grid. For stakeholders, it is important that more charging centers are developed in quick time to create a good environment for the vehicles to be fully operational. Nigeria is, uh, is in a peculiar situation and uh, we have our energy problem. And that is why we in our ministry and through the NADDC are propagating the use of solar panels for charging. And that is why we have done this. So uh, what we're trying to do is we're going to replicate this in more and more places. The more people begin to embrace the use of, uh, of electric cars. Electric vehicles are not just the future, they are the now. Uh, the whole world is moving towards transitioning from fossil fuel to uh, clean energy, powered vehicles, renewable energy. Uh, so such a transportation solution needs sustainable power. When we analyze the power uh, situation in Nigeria, we understand that the opportunities are in renewable energy. So what better way than to leverage that sustainable energy to power these uh, 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 transportation solutions. That is what led to the decision of using the solar power, uh, which you know we have an abundance of solar insulation across the country. So uh, that's what led to that decision. For many, the main challenge in Nigeria is electricity supply. How sustainable this project becomes depends, to a large extent, on overcoming the challenges. We are so much interested in uh, this new in invention of electric cars in Nigeria. Uh, I'm so proud of the DG, that history has been made in Nigeria today, because if you look around, it's going to save a lot of costs. The way the fuel is going up, and people are complaining about things, high price, and high price things are going up in Nigeria. But with this event, it's going to be a balance and you don't have to buy fuel, you know, you can use auto gas, which is cheaper than diesel and fuel. As the manufacturing and purchase of electric vehicles grow around the world, with Nigeria definitely not left behind, it is important that innovative strategies are put in place to provide sustainable power sources for these vehicles.